All right, guys. So in replacement on here, we do need to put a five inch, a five inch media cabinet underneath the furnace. Um, so the return is coming in through here to the left in a box, and then also back from there. So they currently just have it sitting on top of a one inch, um, but we're actually like underneath, and they have to pull apart the furnace, put it in there. Uh, but we're gonna do a five inch with our shorter furnace. Uh, we're also gonna redo the plenum, of course, because we're gonna do a five minute, or a new uh, coil and condenser. Uh, we'll replace our T and our flu. Um, and then in terms of uh, drain, uh, so they've been for 22 years draining into a bucket and emptying it out three times a day in the summer. Uh, we're gonna put a pump in, condensate pump, and we're gonna follow it along uh, the line set that we're removing and pump it out to the side of the home. So the good news is when the homeowner remodeled the attic, uh, there's actually like a little, um, like a, a space he made that he's gonna open up for us that you can access all that stuff all the way out to the side of the home. So everything will be accessible from the attic in, in here. And I say attic, I just put a little floor up there. Um, but yeah, so we'll, we'll run a condensate pump, a line set, coil, furnace, five inch, and uh, in terms of combustion air, we're good because we got louvered doors. So that should be everything.